the future will be defined by significant change. Under these conditions, it's hard to make accurate predictions. Strategic foresight is the contemplation of alternative futures. It allows us to think the unthinkable, to broaden our perspectives on what might occur, to reimagine, to reperceive, to think in options. It also provides us the opportunity to shape our future. By proactively engaging with futures, we can think about what we want and what we don't want and react in time to still shape the future rather than to react to it. The Global Strategic Foresight Community brings together 34 eminent forward-looking thought leaders from leading public, private and civil society organizations. The purpose of the Global Strategic Foresight Community is twofold. First, it provides a diverse, multi-stakeholder peer network for members to compare and contrast their insights. And secondly, the aim of the community is to positively shape future-related agendas by identifying underappreciated or emerging global shifts and bring those to the attention of decision makers. These global shifts are issues or topics that individual community members feel are important for two reasons. One, they represent significant change and therefore could have a big impact on our future. And two, they would really be valuable to put on the agenda now to be discussed further so that we might inspire constructive action around them for the future. Some of the topics, the shifts include underappreciated ideas around the opportunities from ageing societies to different ways in which technology might transform work and sources of economic growth and new ways of thinking about governing the global commons, whether those commons be on land or in space as it becomes increasingly accessible. Over the next two years, the current term of the members, the community will further engage around these global shifts. They will do this with two actions in mind. The first is to deepen their appreciation of these shifts and how they interact, may counter, may enforce each other to get a better understanding of them. And two, to facilitate discussions with people around the world so that we really might have those discussions about looking for innovative solutions so that we might really make the most of the opportunities presented in these global shifts.